Starting back at the duty base, the first thing I did was to get some quests to earn some money and reputation with the dutiers. Do you have anything for me? Nope. Damn, I don't know what it is with these duty soldiers and really being... Uh, they're being tight with the tasks they're giving me. I normally get tons of tasks. They'll like kill the monolith member in Red Forest. There we go, bandits I can do. We need to go to garbage anyway because again we need to look out for the, the shotgun. Remember, the shotgun I'm talking about is the Toz Bison, which is the only ranged weapon we can use in this challenge. Just as I am going to leave, I heard the last thing that any stalker in the zone wants to hear. How come? Okay, well, there's a mission, but... No, oh, we're we'll going to chill by the fire a bit. Are you aware of how you Still wanting the bison, we headed to Garbage to check the flea market trader, as he has the chance to sell one. But we ran into some trouble on the way out. Is there only one dog here? No, that is more than, that is definitely more than one dog. Okay, if we can kill these mutants then we get another quest done. We'll go to Garbage. I'll check out the flea, uh, flea trader, see if he's got our shotgun. Most importantly, uh, see uh, see um how much it costs. There we go. Okay, I wonder if this trader has the shotgun. No, but he has he has an RSAS. Seriously? He has everything but the, the shotgun. And he sells an RSAS. 180k rubles. He doesn't sell just a shotgun with a scope, are you kidding me? And he sells L85. Okay, that, that's kind of a bit more respectable. But he does sell the UMP. Okay, he loses a bit more respect for that. For context here, the L85 is based because it is British. And the UMP is cringe because I don't like it. I don't know, we have to, we'll have to check back on him every now and then, I guess. We had multiple quests to do in garbage, so that was the plan next. Yeah, run through the anomaly for me. I think this just slows him down. Yeah, that's a flesh, I think. It's a weirdly coloured one. Yeah. I thought it was a ball for a second. What the hell? What type of flesh is that? A stalker. I also stopped past Butcher to buy some more shotgun shells for dirt cheap. I'll just sell all this for now. Get as much money as we can. See, this guy sells the normal toss. Not the one we want. Buy some ammo while I'm here. There's a guy in an exosuit up here. Look at this madman. Defending the train hangar with his life. The college is over there. That's why I kind of, I kind of hope that in Stalker 2 there's going to be more passive mobs, mobs, uh, passive mutants, because the only passive mutants in uh, Anomaly is rats and uh, birds. That's it. So I do wish there was going to, is going to be more in Stalker 2, although I don't know. I feel like maybe there should be like a dedicated quest line that isn't like combat focused. I guess, like still stick with the whole idea that ecologists are meant to be peaceful but maybe make it so like yeah you have to go like scan a bunch of fields um what the hell just exploded over there oh what was that random explosions going off behind me i don't think it was a grenade because it, it was like a firing explosion oh yes it was the the rare it was the rare exploding anomaly remember anything Anything un unexplained in this game is just an another anomaly that you, we just don't know about yet. 
Like all those crashes your game has been having, that's just that's just the crash anomaly. It's not the game breaking. It's just it's an intended feature, obviously. <laughs> Toss 34 decorated. Yeah, I think the stats are like they're very slightly different. But obviously, I think the it's, it's got like a black skin, doesn't it? I've <laughs> just got a strong punch. Yeah, we'll we'll head back. We'll s uh, complete the quest. Got a couple to do. I think if we sleep two more times, we'll have the Psy helmet. I don't think it's ready tomorrow. I think it's ready the day after tomorrow. So we'll sleep. Honestly, I may just I may just skip time. The item I'm talking about here is the Psy helmet which is required to do the miracle machine and to go to northern areas in the zone. I then travelled back to the base to repair a new helmet that I had and sleep to the next day. Okay, now we have plenty of money to repair the helmet. Although, do I? No, the, the helmet's definitely more important than the bison because if we're going to do miracle machine, well, miracle machine's all close range. There's no point of having a scope weapon down there. Let's get the helmet repaired, shall we? Uh, nice. There we go. But yeah, that, that's a big increase in... Radiation protection, rupture, well not really rupture, but ballistic, but mainly psi, that's the, the main improvement. Yeah, we'll sleep. And we'll go check the flea market, check all that, get new quests. Okay, I, I think the plan is, I, I think the... The Psy helmet isn't ready yet. I think tomorrow it will be ready. Oh, I should have brought some food out with me. Oh, that's fine. We'll check the flea market. I was planning on sleeping at the flea market because it'll refresh the traders and hopefully we get lucky with the bison. Mm. Although we don't have enough money to buy it, I, I don't presume. It'll probably be quite expensive. Come on, please, 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 please. No. Oh well, we'll just go to Yantar then. So off to Yantar we go, with the hopes to finally acquire the Psy Helmet, but it was far from a peaceful walk there. And I'm planning on doing the Miracle Machine right now. Hopefully. We've got plenty of ammo for it. I feel like 66 rounds. Mm, I may buy some more here. After that unfortunate death, I went back to get my revenge. I just missed both my shots. Okay, one's down. The backup shotgun didn't work. Okay, now I'm making stupid mistakes. Let's try to play a bit smarter. I go and put myself in like a... A bad position. Okay, let me not be an idiot this time and I'll hold the corner now. Gee, let me play smart. I'll fall all the way back so we got good cover. Oh, do you? Hit every shot. Okay, they're pushing. Let me. Let me just play as smart as I can. I think that's probably well, a smart idea. Fall all the way back to here. This is a good place to hold. Got some covering fire. My shotgun jammed. Let me run. I don't think I've had any that much trouble killing a bunch of bandits. Now that I had my revenge, finally, we paid a visit to Sakharov and Yantar to get our Psy helmet. Yeah, ecologist, meant to be the, the peaceful faction, yeah, he's walking around in an exoskeleton. Hey, seriously? Oh? Uh, what the hell is going on here? Okay, 
They're spooked by the door opening by itself. Door anomaly. No. Yes, looks it. We just go through the door anomaly. But this other door won't open unless this one closes. Uh oh. You can't. Okay, close the door. Okay. We actually almost died from that because the door wasn't closing. Unlike half the colleges in Yanta, we barely kept our lives to the anomalous door preventing our safety. So I collected the Psy Helmet from Sakharov and made my way to our next challenge, the Miracle Machine. Oh yeah, one small issue is we don't have... It's a zombie. Okay, go in here, turn around, kill the snork. Or just miss both our shots because we suck at the game. Or just die already because we suck. And he bled out, nice. Okay. This is going to be a good start, isn't it? Where did the zombie go up here? I swear there was a zombie up here. Did he like, climb down the ladder or something? One snort down. See if we can kill as many mutants from up here. Can just about see him. They move around so quickly. Okay, he just ran into a fire anomaly, so that that's good for us. Ah, you can sneak along here, nice. There we go. I need to kill as many as I can now because this is the bloodsucker room. And dealing with snorks plus a bloodsucker is very fun. So there's something stuck in that room. Yeah, you can hear the. Okay, it's a snork. You can hear the projections. Hmm. Okay, how are we gonna do this? If I walk into the room, this room, the bloodsucker will spawn. We need to deal with him. Let's go here. I got one good hit on him. I wonder if he'll bleed out. Or he can just hit the burner. That's also a that's also an option. Okay, we're starting to lose sight health a bit. I mean I don't need to go kill this bureau. Sorry, the um, snork in here. I probably should. Just so he stops spawning. There we go. Yeah, this, I mean, Miracle Machine is quite tricky. Especially when you're forced to do it with only a Toz, especially. It is uh, a bit harder. This blows up, doesn't it? I'm sure that killed something. Okay. The zombie. Sorry, there's another snort on the left. There we go. Which means they're missing all their attacks on us, so we're not actually taking any damage. It's gonna be fun. Come on. There's two bloodsuckers that spawn here. There they are. You can hear them both trigger. Ooh, I wonder if we can kite them into the anomaly. Didn't mean to shoot twice there. Yeah, one's still alive. Try and play around this anomaly. Like that. Perfect. <laughs> okay, that got, that got a bit close, but luckily that anomaly was there to save us. But yeah, the snorks and the zombies here normally aren't 
too much of an issue because you can see them far away. Speaking of which, I actually don't see any. Okay, there's a zombie up. There's a snort. Uh, yeah, let's wait for them to come down. Probably get an easier shot from here. Yeah. Just healed up as well. Doesn't EFP have a uh, proximity mines so you can plant? Uh, yeah, it does. Uh, but, and someone tells me that to use the mines every single time, and I always forget to bring them. Counting every obstacle on the way. is this you plant um, a mine where the bureau spawns because it spawns in the same place every time but I always forget to bring a mine I don't have one do I no. Slugs against zombies, I feel like. They should also work. Trying to fight two snorks at once with a broken double barrel never usually ends well. Let's try that again. Trying to fight one snork with a broken double barrel never ends well. Let's actually try again this time. Okay, let's, let's try this again. Are they gonna come down? Come on, I see you. Uh, let me go have a look. That's one of them. Okay, okay that's all of them. Before I turn off the final one, let me just heal up. Okay, time to deal, deal with the Bureau. Doing good, just finished watching Stalker. Watching Stalker? What you watching? Well, these. Oh, these Stalker moving. Ah, fair enough. I'm gonna have to watch that movie. Okay, well, that was relatively easy. Okay, this is this is the part I was fearing though. I don't know how we're gonna. I don't know how we're gonna kill this controller. 
Honestly, I don't know how we're going to do it. My two buckshot shots or four buckshot shots don't kill him. We're dead. I can fall back, but... Oh. Okay. Well, I was overthinking things. <laughs> that works. And this... Okay. This just further pro uh, proves my point, though. I would rather fight five controllers than one snork. But what really got me in Gunslinger was the Bureaus. The... Some snorks. Hmm, I could... I could skin all these... Okay, I don't know how that guy survived the first shot, but he's dead now. I'm, I have no plans on killing the pseudo-giant, by the way. Just saying that now. I will be running around it like a coward. Especially if a bunch of snorks is giving us so much trouble. They're just giving me more and more reasons to hate Snorps. There we go. There's a dead end there, I don't know where you're going. Yeah, of course we get the zombie with the exoskeleton. And I'm missing my shots. Giant is a waste of ammo? Yeah. It is. I think I've killed it once. But that's because I had a grenade launcher. Okay, let's, let's outrun this pseudo giant, shall we? Where is he? There he is. They can't aim. Completely forgot there's zombies here. Lucky for us, they suck at aiming. Okay, let me just get out of here, please. That's all I want. Payday 2 Swan Dot Song. Double barrel shotgun flashback. Okay, we made it. That is a big sigh of release. Relief, sorry. <laughs>